wonder what the world is going to be like in 17 billion years. Will we travel at the speed of light? Will we have bills? Will... Look right there, kid. You don't even know the world's going to be there in 17 billion years. What do you know, kid? I don't know. That's right, kid. Now let me teach you some stuff about the house of Earth. May end. This is a short film by Shora Roy and Divraj Singh representing Dubai College. Okay, now this is dilemma number one. So our first dilemma occurs in the solar system, with the heart of the solar system called our sun. In the process of fusion, where hydrogen is converted to helium, the sun will grow. It'll be called a red giant. This is what fusion looks like. So what happens when all the hydrogen turns into helium? Is that a very angry sun. The sun will start growing, and as expected, Mercury will be the first to be swallowed. Then comes Venus, and then, of course, us. Quite sad, but the Earth will soon die. For dilemma number two, we must imagine that an asteroid is going to come and hit us. Its size really could matter if it tries to hit us, for different things could happen, as you can see by this rocket. So what happens when our sun's fusion process happens in a really big star? Well, there's a really big boom. And anything close by gets fried. Okay, fine, maybe a bit worse than that. In fact, we may even be vaporized if we're not careful. But what happens when this is a bit worse? Well, this is death situation number four. Our last death situation. When super goes hyper. It's called a hypernova. So this is a really big star. And it was born so large that its fusion process eats up all its hydrogen way too quick. If you can't see it, you're about to see it right now. It destroys the whole galaxy with a concentrated burst of gamma rays, which is deadly to us. And then forms a black hole. 